Hello students, let us see a sum from Partnership Ratio, Exercise 8, page 160. It will be a mix of uh, Tamil and English in my audio, but I will keep it in a very simple English. There are three partners, A, B, C. The old ratio is 3 is to 3 is to 2. Okay. D joins, that is a new partner, for 4 by 7 share. Okay. Now, D takes that 4 by 7 from the old partners as below. That is 2 by 7, 1 by 7 and 1 by 7. So, if you add the 3, you will get 4 by 7. Correct? Okay. So, now we have to find out what is the new ratio. Calculate new ratio. Okay. You also have notebook and pen with you. Let us do together. So, what is new ratio? So you have uh, something earlier. Let, let us say you have a big bar and one person comes and takes something from you, a portion from it. So, the new one is your old one minus what you gave. Right? So, this, this one belongs to you and this one goes to another person. So, in the same analysis, old ratio minus what you sacrifice, that is equal to new ratio. Okay? So, here, in that case, new ratio is 3 is to 3 is to 2 means 3 by 8 minus 2 by 7. Correct? Similarly, 3 by 8 minus 1 by 7. How you got 8? 3 plus 3 plus 2 is 8. 3 is their share, old share. 2 by 7 is already given. 1 by 7 and the third one is 2 by 8 minus 1 by 7. Here is nothing. Here already we know it is 4 by 7. We can continue. So now to minus these two are uh, what do you call you cannot find LCM if it is uh, let us say like 12 then you can get uh, 24 as LCM so these two numbers are not useful between each other so you, you can get 56 as the LCM 87 56 so here 37 are 21 minus 16 right again 56 LCM 21 minus 8 okay again 56 LCM 14 minus 8 come on 4 by 7 so these are the the how I am writing is all the partners each column so this this one is A this one is B this one is C this one is D okay so, the new is 21 minus 16 is 5 by 56 is to 21 minus 8 is 13 by 56. So, you are getting uh, some very, uh, what do you call, odd numbers or different numbers. No. Not uh, in the ratio of the old one, this are big denominator. So, 4 by 7, you can write it as into 8 if you multiply 8 by 8. So, which is equal to 32 by 56, right? Okay. So, that is equal to 5 is to 13 is to 6 is to 32. Yeah, it's a very a unique strange. Okay, but how do you know, how do we know that the ratio is right? We have to add everything and we have to see whether we get 56. So, 13 plus 5, 18, 18 plus 6, 24. So, 24 plus 32 equal to correct 56. Okay, this only just a cross verification. So, the new ratio is 5 is to 13 is to 6 is to 32. Okay. So, please do it on your own. And if you have any doubt, please leave it in the comment section. Thank you.